Hey, what up everybody? It's Adi with GameStorm and uh, today I'm doing a pickup video and this pickup video is kind of different. Usually, me and Gary, uh, when it comes to pickup videos, we like to get a bunch of stuff together and then put them all in one big pickup video and, you know, I like to do that. Um, seems better than just like, oh, I picked up three things, let's put this in a video. You know, meh. But uh, this, this pickup video is a little bit different. Um, I'm going to do like a specific kind of pickup video, um, and it's not about games. This is more of like the nerd side of me <laughs> coming out than the gamer side. Uh, this is all about anime and manga or manga, whatever you want to call it. And uh, as you can see, what I'm wearing, um, it's probably going to involve DBZ or DB, whatever you want to call it. So yeah, let's get started. Anyways, first thing I want to show is some manga. I got the original uh, Dragon Ball Volume 1. Um, this is the hardcover collector's edition. Um, this has a sleeve. The actual, like, book itself, if you were to get the paper one, it looks like that. That's what it looks like without the sleeve. So, this is really good. This is actually a really, really good book. Um, obviously you read it from right to left if you don't know about manga, but you can see it's got some colored pages in there. Um, and then it goes to black and white sometimes, but this book is very, very good. Uh, I already read it, read it in one day, like a couple hours. Um, it reads really fast, it's really funny. <laughs> so if you've never read the actual manga of Dragon Ball, um, I highly recommend getting this. Very good, very good. So that's the only one I have so far. I'm gonna be buying all of them eventually for my collection, but yeah. All right, so let's get to some uh, DVDs of the actual show now. Well, let's see. This isn't actually a pickup. I've had this, you know, one of the orange bricks. I got this like 2006 or something. I don't, I don't remember, but a long time ago. But, uh, you know, you know what these are. If you don't know, these are called the orange bricks. Uh, the reason I'm telling you this is you will see I have a bunch of different kinds of DVZ stuff. So, um, yeah. Anyways, these are the orange bricks. These are cheap, um, pretty good quality. They have the Bruce Faulkner music. They are the only one that has the Bruce Faulkner music. So if you like the American Bruce Faulkner music, the rock and roll stuff, this is the one that you want to have. So yeah, anyways, there's that. This is season three, if you, didn't, if you wanted to know, if you didn't see that, but Freeze the Saga, pretty much. But, uh, let's do this one first. Dragon Box 1. Yes, Dragon Boxes. Um, these things are freaking legit. It's a hard box, really, really nice. Um, so you get a better view of it. But uh, the side of it, as you can see, if you get all of them, it makes a picture of Goku and Gohan. Um, the uh, Japanese versions of these, there's only two of them. And they're just like huge. <laughs> and one's like Goku, one's Gohan. And they go next to each other. But these are separated in like seven Dragon Boxes, I think. And yeah, it makes the picture how they go along. But um, it comes with these, which is, you know, the actual DVDs, um, come in a really nice box. These, I mean, these are really high quality. Really, really high quality stuff. And, uh, I, I really love this. Here's what the inside looks like. It's got three discs in it. This is the, uh, Saiyan Saga, obviously. This is, a uh, Dragon Box 1. But it comes with two of these, where it has, like, the DVDs, but then it also comes with the middle part. And it is a book type thing. Um, it's very, very nice. I'll open it up and show you. You read it from right to left, obviously. But Dragon Box Volume 1 has a bunch of just interesting little tidbits and stuff. It tells you, it's kind of like an uh, episode guide, really. It tells you, like, tells you about what the episode is. Then it has cool stuff like the history of Dragon Ball. I don't know if you can see that, but it has, like, dates and, like, when stuff happened, just when the show was created, just stuff like that. It's just really, really neat. You know, I don't know, but I really like this. Um, I, I want to get all of them, but if you know anything about collecting these, Dragon Box 2, this one, I'll just tell you right now, this one, I think I bought this off eBay for 70 I want to say. Um, it's worth around, what, how much is it worth around? <laughs> uh, I want to say like 200. I think it's worth 200, but got it for 70. Now Dragon Box 2, new is like 700. Um, <laughs> something stupid like that. 
used 250 or something, 300, I don't know. So I have not got that, but that's gonna take me a while, so yeah. All right, now, this next part is my all-time favorite DBZ pickup ever. And there's three, there's three things. Now, if you guys don't know, I'm not gonna go into a huge spiel over it, but there's different dubs, American dubs, English dubs, whatever, of the series. There's the uh, Ocean dub, and then there's the Funimation dub. Now, the Orange Bricks, like I showed you, have the Funimation dub. The Ocean dub is only episodes one through 53. Now, if you watch the show like I did, uh, when it first came out here in America, <laughs> and I was a little kid. Um, I remember me and my friend Ricky, we watched it and once it got into the Namek Saga, all of a sudden one day, everyone's voices just completely changed. And we were like, uh, well, what happened? And we would ask our friends, we're like, yo man, does his voice sound different? They're like, no, you're stupid, man, you're stupid. You don't know what you're talking about, it's the same. And we're like, okay, I guess we were just hallucinating. But come to find out, it really did change, so we're not crazy. <laughs> what happened was like, Funimation went and hired the Ocean Dub cast to do the voices for DBZ originally. Then some other people bought the rights to the Ocean Dub cast, and so um, Funimation wasn't able to use them. So once it got to episode 53 on like Cartoon Network or whatever, they're like, oh crap, now what? Uh, I guess we'll just have to use in-house voices, so they used the Funimation crew. And then from then on, they just used the Funimation voices actors, and like we were like, what happened? But <laughs> yeah, so anyways, my pickup is the Ocean Dub. So the first thing I'll show you is this case right here. This is the Ocean Dub, um, the first three DBZ movies, which are, as you can see, The Dead Zone, uh, World's Strongest, and Tree of Might, which Tree of Might is probably my favorites. Um, but yeah, this is the Ocean Dub of those. I'll show you what these kind of look like. Um, here's what the actual DVD case looks like. It's really cool. It's got cool artwork, that's the one thing I like. And they are the Pioneer set, also, that's what they're also called. You can see my camera in there, that's nice. But uh, <laughs> yeah, um, Pioneer, as you can see up here, those are the ones that actually produced the Ocean Dub, and like they stopped producing it back in like mm, 2001 or something like that. These originally came out like 98 or 96, something crazy. So these are old, <laughs> and these are hard to find. Um, so yeah, I'm really glad I got these. Now, the other parts are, here is the Ocean Dub, this is a box set, this is the season one. Um, as you can see, it has some artwork, and it goes around the side, in this really cool box. But yeah, this is the Ocean Dub season one. And then there's all the DVDs. It has little Dragon Balls that like show, one, two, three, one, six, seven, and like what disc number or whatever <laughs> box it is. Um, I'll show you what one of them looks like. It's the same kind of thing, has Pioneer at the top. But it shows you what episodes are on it. But yeah, this this is season one. And I'm so glad I got this. They only have, you know, obviously since this is one episodes one through fifty-three, there's only gonna be up till episode fifty-three. So this is season two, and this is up to episode fifty-three, so here's the side of it. The back. The other side, it's got Vegeta, and then the boxes, and the actual cases, so. Really glad I got this. Really happy. This is like my best pickup ever because the Ocean Dome, in my opinion, is so much better. <laughs> I love it. So, yeah, that was my DBC DB pickups. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, leave comments if you love Dragon Ball Z and Dragon Ball, because I love them. It's probably my second favorite anime. Uh, my first favorite is another anime which um, I will be showing you in another pickup video because I have a bunch of stuff for that coming in and I'll just do that all at once just like I did these. So, hope you guys liked it. Leave your comments about what I got. Um, yeah, thanks guys. See ya.